Midday Kentucky everyone. Well even though it's cold outside spring, warm weather are quickly approaching. Now a lot of people start thinking about getting healthier and in shape right now, but while we're all trying to be health conscious, it's important to remember the good old choppers people. Why is it important to keep our smile healthy? Of course, we've got Dr. Jessica McClanahan, owner of Healthy Smiles of the Bluegrass. How are you my friend? I'm great, thank you for having me. Of course, we love having you in here. Interesting enough, we think what do we need to do to create the healthy smile? It's not just about eating well. No, um, you know, you really need to just take care of your smile. Um, and there are a few things you can do daily. Um, brushing twice a day, yeah. flossing once a day. Um, those things just help, help keep your smile nice and healthy. So something that I thought was really interesting, people who are neglecting their smile or their teeth, like in their gums, mm -hmm. you know, you hear so many solutions at home things to do, like tips and tricks. Mm -hmm. But where does one start? Like I know they need to call you, mm -hmm. but then where do we start with that? What do we do when we get in there to see you? Well, you know, if, if you've been neglecting, you really want to um, just decide to recommit to a good oral health. Um, we can help you form some nice healthy habits to mm -hmm. keep your smile healthy, um, starting with teaching you proper brushing techniques, proper flossing techniques, um, things that you can do at home to maintain a healthy smile. And look, you know, some people don't have health insurance. Right. Okay, so it becomes expensive for mm -hmm. people to go in. So even if you can just have a clean once a year, That's right. does make a big difference, it does. doesn't it? Mm -hmm. You just touched on something, and it's something that I often think about when I'm at home or buying toothbrushes myself. I never know which is the right way to be brushing. Mm -hmm. Should I be doing a soft, medium, or hard brush? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Well, we always recommend a soft bristle ah. brush. Ah. Um, yes. Uh, but I like the feel of the hard one. Uh, I feel like I'm cleaning my gums. Yes. Uh, and <laughs> I, and I, we get that from a lot of people. <laughs> but um, the softer bristle brushes, they actually help um, prevent some recession yeah. caused by those harder bristle, bristle brushes. Okay. Um, and so we always recommend a soft bristle Explain brush. Explain to me what recession is. What do you mean by that? So when the gums kind of recede away from the tooth oh. um, and you start to see more of the That's tooth. That's not a good look. No. 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 Um, <laughs> uh, something that, look, I'll be honest with everyone at home. I'm not a fan of flossing, you know, but I do love going to the dentist. Mm -hmm. um, good and bad ways of flossing? Oh, yes. Um, you definitely, you know. Uh, <laughs> and you probably hate me saying I don't floss every day. Well, you know, that's okay. Um, I, I try to, to tell people if you'll kind of keep the floss around, maybe put mm -hmm. it by your recliner chair or leave it out in the bathroom. It kind of becomes a nagging sign oh, that you need to floss. Okay. So, um, but, you know, one thing is when people floss, they tend to put the floss up there and saw back and forth. Yeah. And that's, that's not the right way to floss. So that, that actually will hurt your gums. Okay. Um, so you want to kind of wrap it around like a C, um, around the tooth structure, and gently up and down. Oh. Um, mm -hmm. Well, that's what I'm doing wrong because literally when I put it in my mouth, it goes from the top of my tooth down and I feel like it's gone into my <laughs> yeah. gum. And then it's like saw and I'm like... Seesawing yeah. it backwards yeah. and forwards. Right, that's you what a lot of people And do. that's why I yeah. hate it. Yeah. But I love a good toothpick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's the craziest yeah. thing. Um, now, we're doing those things at home, mm -hmm. but then we might start to see some gum bleeding. Mm -hmm. How do we know, you know, we know because we talk about it all the time, mm -hmm. that's not a healthy sign. Right. What, what, what are some of the signs at home? if you haven't been to the dentist, that you have an unhealthy smile? Well, if your gums are bleeding when you're brushing or flossing, you know, that's a, a sure sign that you have something going on. Uh, you should probably get in to see the dentist. Um, you know, if you haven't been flossing for a while, um, your gums aren't bleeding when you're brushing, mm. but they start to bleed when you've just picked back up the habit of flossing. Okay. Sometimes that's normal. Yeah. Um, and so I always tell patients, don't stop flossing just because your gums are bleeding. They're bleeding because they're not used to you flossing. Oh, so got you. Right. So once you get used to that, that that'll stop. Uh, what, one of the things that I love about you when you come in here is that you always bring a little promotion in. And mm -hmm. something that I w did want to ask you about, let's pop that promotion up right now. At Clear Correct, the procedure, $500 off through to the end of March. There's the phone number to, to call. $500 off Clear Correct. Very quickly, explain to everyone at home what is Clear Correct? Clear Correct is a series of invisible aligners that work just like braces. Oh. Um, the benefit is nobody knows you're wearing them. So um, adults, um, even teenagers, are loving this because it's, it's you know, it's clear. 
um, I think that is fantastic. Mm -hmm. So instead of seeing the metal braces, oh look, there they are right now. Mm -hmm. She's got clear correct on, has that's, she? That's right. They look mm -hmm. amazing. Mm -hmm. Now, how often would we be needing to wear these? All day, every day? We'd want Take to them wear off them just to eat. Just to eat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. Otherwise, you'll eat them. Though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> clear correct. Hey, thank you so much. Let's put up all the information about yeah. how to get hold of you. Really appreciate you mm -hmm. coming in again. There's the promotion right there. There's the phone number to ring. Or go onto their website. It's really easy to navigate. Hey, you're just around the corner from the station. That's right. Yeah. I should come over. Good. How do you know if you're the right person to have clear correct? You need to come in and have a consultation. Well, it's not for everyone. The, the consults are free. Mm -hmm. um, we will send your. We'll take impressions. We'll take some pictures. I got um, you. Pain free. Okay. Um, we'll send it off, and then we'll we'll give you a call and let you know if you're a candidate. All right. Well, we really appreciate you. Thanks for coming in again. Thanks for having me. Hey, everyone. Stick with us. You're watching Midday Kentucky.